Apple launched the iPhone 14 and iPhone 14 Pro in September 2022. However, there have been speculations about the iPhone 15 for a while now, even before the release of the latest iPhones. Despite its release being a few months away, Apple usually has a hard time keeping details of its iPhone lineups a secret. This is because there are many suppliers involved in the production process, and some of them often leak information. Let's take a look at the most recent updates on the iPhone 15. No Touch ID Although there were rumors that Apple might reintroduce Touch ID to its top-tier iPhones through an under-display solution, the iPhone 15 is unlikely to have this feature and will stick with Face ID. Another rumor that has been quashed is the addition of a periscope zoom lens to the iPhone 15 models. This technology will only be available on the larger iPhone 15 Pro Max. The iPhone 15 Pro will feature a standard zoom lens, while the iPhone 15 models will only have wide and ultra-wide lenses. Camera Design The iPhone 15 models are expected to feature advanced image sensors from Sony, which have twice the saturation signal in each pixel. This technology can capture more light, improve portraits, and reduce underexposure and overexposure, even in strong backlighting. It is not yet clear if all iPhone 15 models will have this technology or if it will be exclusive to the higher-end Pro models. There are also rumors that the iPhone 15 Pro Max will have a periscope zoom lens, while the iPhone 15 Pro will have a standard zoom lens, and the iPhone 15 models will only have wide and ultra-wide lenses. Apple analyst Ming-Chi Kuo predicts that when Apple adopts periscope lens technology, it will introduce 6x optical zoom capabilities. USB-C port Apple is planning to replace the lightning port on the upcoming iPhone 15 devices with a USB-C port. This means that Apple will either have to make this design change for all iPhones worldwide or create special versions of the device specifically for sale in Europe. According to reliable sources, Apple will indeed be making this change. This move will allow Apple customers to charge their Mac, iPhone, and iPad devices using a single charging standard. USB-C Data Transfer Speeds The iPhone 15 Pro models that come with USB-C ports will support faster data transfers than the standard iPhone 15 models. The standard iPhone 15 models will continue to feature USB 2.0 speeds, which are the same as those of the Lightning port. However, with the upgrade to USB-C, the iPhone 15 Pro models will be able to transfer video and other files at much quicker speeds. The iPhone 15 Pro models will support USB 3.2 or Thunderbolt 3, which have speeds of up to 20 gigabits per second and 40 gigabits per second, respectively. Battery Life In terms of battery life, the iPhone 15 models are expected to come with larger battery capacities compared to the iPhone 14 models, thanks to more space freed up by the removal of the notch. However, it's unclear if the battery life will be significantly improved compared to the iPhone 14. Ming-Chi Kua has reported that the iPhone 15 models will come with improved 5G technology that will consume less power, which could lead to better battery life. Storage Options The iPhone 15 models are expected to come with the same storage options as the iPhone 14 models, including 128GB, 256GB, and 512GB for the standard models and up to 1TB for the Pro models. However, there have been rumors that Apple may introduce a new 2TB storage option for the Pro models, which would be a first for the iPhone lineup. Release Date Apple typically announces new iPhones in September, but there have been reports that the iPhone May 15th be delayed due to supply chain issues caused by the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. Analysts predict that the iPhone 15 could be delayed by a few weeks, which would push its release date to October or November. While there is still a lot of speculation and rumors surrounding the iPhone 15, it's clear that Apple is looking to make some significant changes to the device. The transition to USB-C, the removal of the notch, and the potential use of Sony's advanced image sensors are just a few examples of the changes we can expect. As always, the new iPhone is likely to come with a new and improved processor, better battery life, and improved 5G technology. It will be interesting to see how these changes impact the overall user experience of the iPhone 15.